Hi folks, Baz Garris Strongman here. Today I'm going to take you through a shoulder workout. Not my typical workout, I've got a few different things planned today, but I'm going to take you through the basics. Um, I've done my warm up, I don't need to show you that. I've done, I show it in a previous video, but I've done a bit of cardio, starting off with a cross trainer, waking that spine up, getting the shoulders moving. Um, I've done a couple of rounds on the slam man, particularly focus on warming those shoulders up. And then as I, st as I start any shoulder day, I start with some face pulls, which I'll show you on the next video, just to wake up the rear delts, get them involved. After my bit of cardio warm up and use of the bands, rotator cuff, I start my shoulder warm up with some face pulls religiously now, warm up the rear delts, get them involved. There's different ways of doing a face pull. I find this on a bit of a incline because of my high cable, gives you that angle. So you're trying to pull towards your face horizontally really, perpendicular I should say, to your body. Nothing too heavy, you don't really want to completely exhaust them so they're not involved, but just like waking them up a bit, I suppose. I often neglected most shoulder exercises, such as just going to follow now, heavily focus on the front delts, uh, most of your log from pressing, even a lot of your dumbbell work. So it's important to try and involve the rear delts and the mesial delts. And I'll come on to that a little bit later on. So I've done my face pulls now, just to wake up the rear delts. I'm just going to do some basic dumbbell pressing now to continue warming the delts up. Nice and light now. Just get them moving a bit. Excuse the truck going past. Changing hand positions a little bit. Oh, nice. So a standard shoulder session for me is going to focus on the three delts separately, the three heads. The front delt, the medial delt, and the rear delt. And it's important to make sure you're doing some exercises that hits each one of those specifically. Um, as I said, most shoulder exercises, most pressing, are gonna hit the front delts a little bit more. And for most people, including myself, front delts are nicely developed. Medial delts to a lesser degree, rear delts, a little bit ignored, a little bit lacking, should we say. Um, so my session today is going to focus on a pressing to start with, um, a couple of new exercises which I'm going to get into, but generally takes that format. My heavier work's done first when I'm fresh, particularly if I'm doing log or anything picking up off the floor, which is quite energy sapping, so I like to get it done first. Then you've got to pay special attention, the medial delts and the rear delts, as I say, particularly forming those rear delts at the end. But if you're lacking, it makes sense to do that in a reverse order. Hit your rear delts first, um, particularly if you're looking at bodybuilding or anything like that. Focus on those first while you're fresh. Um, and if I was doing more bodybuilding sort of stuff, I'd probably exhaust those first, work those first, the medial delts and then the front delts. 
But when I'm sort of strongman focused, it's the other way round. As I say, I'm going to do my pressing first when I've got the energy. So here we go. This is for Marcus. Just starting off with the bar for now because I haven't done this before. Okay, that's easy enough. to work on my wrists. Up to 30 kilos now. Still not sure about that turn. Maybe you did it on your video, Marcus. I'll have to have a look at it again. Or did you go straight away from that? Part is that wrist stability. I might have to put my straps on. Here we go, Marcus. I've built up to 40 now. I think this is going to be a challenge for me. Got my wrist straps on, stop me and snapping off. it was. Go to the other side to balance it out. Oof. Nah. What a good day there. kilos more, this is 80, and I need a longer axle, I need to get a bit close here. Yeah. I'm just going to do the one year and maybe have a look at a PB. If I can get this one up, of course. I have no right going for a PB today. It just calls me. not happening, never mind the PB. Explosion. Let's explode off the floor. Oh, 
Put your hand on whack in your chest. Let's get this. Get this and call it a day. Well, for the red pressing anyway. Come on. Just getting this out for a little go. This is ninety. Be a hundred. Hundred. Two hundred and twenty pounds. Pretty comfortable, but I'd be stupid to go for a PB. So let's go for a PB. Right, I'm not building up any further. I'm jumping straight to 110, give it a crack. Bit stupid, but that's my little name. I will do it, it's not stupid, I'm going with it. Oh, yes. That's a 
prosecute the nose. Ah, lightweight. Should have had that. Almost surprised myself how these hips go in. It's a lot of flex at the top. Take two, 110 kilos. No mess about this time. Have a blast on my running out from Kenzie's salts. Right in my hands, which didn't help, but I've done too much pressing, it's not going to happen today. I know it's there though soon. Right, guys, I train a bit intuitively now. I've got a basic structure, but I will bend and break it a bit depend on if, how the session goes. Um, today is a good example of that because it's been nice outside and I've been able to do more pressing, like getting my log out and things. I've done far more strongman stuff, if you like, than I was intending to do. So it's become a strongman session, um, heavily focused on the front delt, a lot of overhead pressing. Um, I've been in the gym far too long now and I gotta get back in the house and do some homeschooling with the kids. It's 10 o'clock, so I gotta get them on it. Um, if I don't, they'll just be playing all day. So I'm gonna call it a day there. Um, as I say, if I'd done less work, I would have, like a more bodybuilding session, I would have tried to equal the work on the front, the medial and the rear delt. Um, I would have probably added in some Arnold presses, maybe some Aaron's presses. Again, see how it goes. I got, as I say, I've got a loose program. So this is push day, stroke, shoulder day. Um, but I will change it as I go along. Um, so I'm going to finish off with some more face pulls just to give the rear delts a little bit of work and then call it a day, I'm exhausted, my arms hurting, my shoulders hurting, just holding this phone up. So, as I say, um, I'll feature different sessions, different shoulder workouts to come, uh, and they'll be a bit more rounded around the shoulder, but this has been pretty much a strongman session today. So, I just love it, you know, and as I say, when the sun's out, I'd rather be out pressing my log. When it's raining next week, I'll be more stuck inside, limited, I won't be able to do overhead presses so much unless they're seated because of the slight height restriction. I can't stand up and press unless I'm right in the middle and it's a little bit awkward. So I'll I'll do much more rounded um, session next week and, and really hit the different heads of the delts from you know different positions, different exercises. So that's my session today, folks. Hope you've enjoyed it. Please drop a thumbs up if you have done. And please subscribe to my channel for future Strongman content. I've been Baz, Garage Strongman. See you soon.